the draft and what was your reaction to getting picked for this franchise? Um, I was just down in Irvine, uh, just out of LA. I was just really with uh, one of my mates, or oh, two of my mates, and uh, I was just watching TV. Uh, my agent called my, my friend and FaceTime with him, and I kind of knew, started paying attention. And uh, yeah, I was just super excited, super happy to hear my name called, and especially to a team like this. Um, that was a great feeling. Do you have any sense that pre-draft work out here went particularly well? Do you connect well with anybody? Um, yeah, I had a, I felt like I had a really good workout here. Um, I was you know, really happy with the way it went uh, going away from it. Had a you know, good conversation with the coaches and things like that uh, over lunch as well. So I, I definitely left here with a good feeling. And, uh, I was really happy with my name. How have you fit in with this group so far? Yeah, I think um, we're really bonding a lot. Uh, you know, obviously we've only been together a couple of days, most of us, but you know, you wouldn't be able to tell from watching us play. We're kind of building a lot of chemistry pretty quick, and uh, we feel good playing out there with each other. How much are you looking forward to summer league and getting a chance to kind of show what you got? Yeah, I can't wait. I think uh, opportunities like that are pretty rare. So, um, yeah, just excited to get out there uh, with the boys and uh, see how we stack up. Who have you mostly been going against out here? In practice? Yeah. I've been matching up with uh, the guards on the other squad, uh, Ben Matthew and Ben Shepard mainly. Um, so just... You know, cutting those guys, obviously, they're both really good scoring the ball. So, just, it's a really good challenge for me defensively. And with Ben, a little reunion, I guess, of you guys again. Yeah, known him a long time now. So, it's good to see, you know, how far he's come and how much success he's had. But, you know, also still being able to compete with him. So, it's a lot of fun. How much more comfortable are you now after just a few days of settling in here and, and learning your new teammates and some of their tendencies? Yeah, way more comfortable. I've only been here, you know, four or five days now. But I feel like I've been here a lot longer. Just, you know how nice everyone's been and uh, how, how well everyone's just clicked together. What's just sort of the plan for you going forward? Obviously, I understand that you're probably going to be playing internationally you know, next year as well. Do you know where yet and what's, you know, what's the plan going forward you know, at, at this point? Yeah, um, that, that is the plan. Um, probably just spend a year somewhere, um, but I'm not sure where yet. Um, kind of just focus on summer league right now. My agent's kind of working on a couple of things behind the scenes, but he's not really bothering me with it. He just wants me to stay focused on you know, the task at hand right now, which is just preparation and then going into summer league. Are you open to anything? Or are you trying to get back, play close to home, in, you know, NBL, or is, is it, are you open to Europe, or is it just sort of wide open for you? Yeah, it's uh, pretty much wide open for me. I'm really just looking for the best situation for my development, and, um, you know, obviously you want to play at the highest level possible. So, uh, just uh, whatever, whatever the best situation is. You remember playing with them on the tournament team for everyone? Yeah, I remember playing with them. We uh, we won a tournament in Spain together, so that was a lot of fun. <laughs> um, Benedict from Benedict Sports here. <laughs> Got a little question for you. How you feel about um having a teammate? You know, who went to the academy with you. Yeah, it was good to get out here and compete against him. You know, beat him the last three days. So. Um, <laughs> <laughs> He's out. <laughs> <laughs> Same as well, you remember him? Yeah, yeah. It hasn't changed. What led to your willingness to have that flexibility of what's next? Because some guys might be so determined on one path or the other yeah. versus you seem much more flexible and open to op other opportunities. Yeah, I mean, my journey's already been, you know, yeah. different. Uh, so, you know, I know everyone has a different pathway and everyone takes a different route to, to get to their goals. And um, I'm not really set on... You know, one way or the other, I'm just looking for the best situation for me to develop and continue to grow as a player. Where do you think you benefited most from becoming a pro at such a young age compared to some of your peers here? Yeah, I think just, you know, my IQ, my training habits, just being around such high-level competition at a young age and, you know, really good players being able to learn from them, good coaches as well, and just just learning so much at a young age I think has a, a real benefit for a young player, just building those habits the right way from the start. Who are some of the players in the league currently that you watch closely or, or try to maybe pull things from their game? In the NBA? For yours, yeah. 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 Um, so I watch a lot of Devin Booker. I watch, like, how he operates offensively. I think as a two guard, that's a really good player to watch in terms of just, you know, how you get to your shots and get to your spots.